Hi guys, so today I wanted to show you all the products and stuff that I got over the weekend. Um, I went shopping with my sister and we got a whole bunch of cool stuff. So, let's get started. Um, first thing I got was this lipstick because I'm a sucker for lipstick. I'm wearing it right now. It is Rimmel? Looks like Rimmel. Yep, it's Rimmel. Rimmel's Diva Red, number 500. I like it. It's really pretty. Basic, staple red. Especially for fall. Like, the darker reds like this make a pop in your outfit, even though I'm wearing pajamas. <laughs> but, yeah. Next thing I got was this lip liner, because I really, really needed some. and still got the packaging on it. I couldn't get it off. But, um, this is L'Oreal, and the color is always red, so that's really nice. Definitely, like, even if you just want to wear this, like, all over your lips, as like a matte lipstick, it works really well, like, I don't know, it's just super cool. And then, of course, my favorites, I got this. Master Highlight by Maybelline Bronzer and the color Light Bronze. My other one broke and I was really, really sad, so I decided to pick up a new one. It's definitely worth the, like, $8. And then I got another highlight, whatever, face studio thingy, and this one is the blush, and it's in the color Pink Rose. I kind of tried this out over the last couple days, and... I didn't really like it and I was disappointed because it's just too pigmented. If you're into the like darker pigment blush then definitely go for this but I'm probably not going to use it a whole lot. I'm definitely going to use this blush though by e.l.f. Um, this is what it looks like. It's kind of like a darker pink which is more my thing. It's called Tickled Pink. And that's really nice. I'm wearing that right now. A lot of this stuff I'm wearing right now. But yeah, then the next thing I got, I already have the original Scandalize, but I decided to pick up this one too because it was pink. And um, yeah, this works better than the original Scandalize, but I don't know. It like It has one of those plasticky brushes, and I'm not all for that. But it works decently. It was worth the money. And then I picked up two concealers. Um, I got this Instant Age Rewind. This stuff is magic. You definitely need this in your life. It's by Maybelline. It's the best thing ever. Go buy it. Like now. And then I got another concealer. The e.l.f. Tone Correcting Concealer. Um, it's okay. Decent travel-sized concealer if you're packing stuff somewhere, or like you're on the go, you need a concealer, just grab this, throw it in your bag, and you're done. And then I got probably the coolest thing ever. Like, I really needed a face primer, and I have a lot of redness on my face, so I've heard about these, like, green ones, and this one is so cool. Like, it looks super green on the camera, but it's actually not that green. Um, it is really nice, though. Like, it goes on that green color, and then it kind of, like, mixes into your face and, like, covers up all your redness, and it smells really good. Ow, my cat. And it also, like, covers up your redness. I forget what I was saying. But, yeah. Go get it. It was only $6 for a primer. That's, like, the cheapest I've ever seen a primer. So, definitely go pick that up when you have a chance. And then, second to last thing I got was... It's kind of breaking apart now. If you can see that. This NYC... Smooth Skin Pressed Face Powder. I thought it would be like a translucent powder, but it's not. It's good for highlighting, but it's already breaking up, so I wouldn't really recommend this. Uh, 
kind of a little waste. And then, last thing, last but not least, well, kind of least, because I didn't like it, but this e.l.f. waterproof eyeliner pen. It's okay, I'm wearing it right now. Um, but it goes on kind of weird, like you have to put a couple layers, and then if you mess up, it gets everywhere, and you have to like take a makeup wipe and wipe your whole eye off, and it's just a hassle, like... I don't know if it's just all eyeliner pens that I have problems with, or if it's just this one, but this one's not that great. Sorry, Elf. But I like your other products, so you can deal with that. And yeah, that is all I got. Um, if you want to give me any suggestions for future videos, that'd be awesome. Because I'm kind of running out of ideas here. But um, yeah. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel because I put out new videos all the time. And I will see you guys later. Bye.